Hello, I'm Aubrey St. John from Cessna Team Structures. I've got another photography video for you guys today. Today, I'll be covering the basics of focusing when taking pictures with your camera. One of the most overlooked elements of a photograph is its focus. Team Structures will on average receive about 30 to 40% of pictures out of focus and unusable. To reduce delays, always make sure the correct area on the image is in focus before emailing. Most digital cameras will have a two-stage autofocus button built into the shutter release button when capturing a photo. This means the first stage of the button of the button press will activate the camera's autofocus. Fully pressing the shutter release button down will snap the photo. Once you've mastered the autofocus hardware, direct your attention to the camera's LCD screen where it will have a focus box. It will typically just be centered. Remember that whatever is in the box, whether it be two feet away or 40 feet away, that is what will be in focus. Some of the newer cameras will have a touch to focus screen. This allows you to simply tap on the area you want in focus. Most newer smartphones will also work this way. This is a good example of how a centered focus box can result in an out of focus image. As you can see, the user was attempting to take a picture of the corrosion around a fastener hole, but the focus box autofocuses on the content several feet back within the fastener hole. So in this case, the image is focused on the floor. When taking pictures from just a couple inches from the damage, be sure your camera is set in macro mode for close-up imaging. Focusing in macro mode will have a shallow depth of field, so pay close attention to the focal point. Following these general guidelines will ensure that your pictures are sharpened in focus. One important thing to remember is to always review your images before sending them off in an email to be sure that they're in focus. Thank you for watching and if you have any questions, please contact us here at Team Structures.